well, morning campers. It's uh, 7 45. Something like that. Oh, yeah. It's the 7th of October, I think. Something like that. Yeah, 7th, I think. So. Yeah, it's the 7th. 21 degrees in here. Nicely, nicely. Up on the ranges. Uh, one of my usual haunts, stops. I haven't had no hassle or anybody, anything. It's just a bit weird up here. Let me uh, show you. It's just gone um, sunrise. I won't see it. The sun's over there. I don't know if you can see up there. You can see those things. See that? There's loads of rubbish been dumped there in the gateway. If you can make that out. And just down the track there a little bit, there's some tires. I don't know if you can see them up there or not, but just up there, there's some tires. So somebody's dumping up here. If you go over um, there where that um, mast is, between that, well, behind those trees to the right, there's a road up there that goes right the way down past the golf course and down to Warminster. And that's what I was told, that we weren't allowed to park there on a public road because it went through military property, which is a little bit of rubbish. I would say the red flag's flying. So, as far as it is, you can't go across there, but, but where that gate is, there and down there, you see the track. Well, not this, you see the fucking water. It goes up there. Walkers are still walking across there. So, um, there you go. Well, what a beautiful colour. This colour's a bit richer than it is on the screen. That light and red glow in the bottom is lovely. It's a beauty, it's a beautiful sky. And where is he, like, over there? And yeah, how beautiful that sky is over there. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Anyway, peeps. I don't know what's uh, what's appertaining. Oh, in me uh, Christmas duvets, which I duvet covers, but I bought the other day, which is lovely, lovely. So I've got to cover myself up because the window's open. Uh, yeah. Right. Shut the window out, home, will it? Generating all this bloody heat and then giving it, and then giving it away. Yeah, so um, what's happened there? I ain't got a clue. Um, get off and do some of this first. Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to think. I might, uh, where my TV is up there. I got the two, see the two doors there that they bifold, all that. Um, where the telly goes in that cover, that had bifold doors, I might took them off. But I think I'm gonna, um, where I've got, I brought them with me. I think we see them in the toilet on the floor. But I think I should cover them today and uh, put them up. May do. May not do. Uh. Mm, fancy booted off somewhere, really, but I don't know. I don't know whether it's or not. But, um, yeah. So I ain't got nothing, I ain't got really anything to say this morning. I'll think of something that, that later on, I suppose. But I can't really sort of feel this day. Feel that you're looking at that bloody sky. It's absolutely beautiful. Anyway, I'll waste no more of your time. I'll speak to you all later. Oh, thank you for the uh, new subscribers. I'm well over 500 now. On my way to a thousand. If I can get a thousand, then we can do some live chats. Which, um, maybe like it or not, but I'm quite opinionated. And if people want my opinion, I don't tend to give my opinion out. Yeah, so I don't do it all the time. Sometimes I've got something to say, but, you know, it is a bit with me when you uh, ask my opinion. Don't ask my opinion if you want the answer you want. Ask my opinion to get my opinion, because that's what you'll fucking get. Um, 
Yeah. I can't see all this problems about parking on where I normally park. I mean, because I've been, like I said to you, I've been wandering these hills for 60 years, since I was about 10 years old. And when you're doing wrong, we've been bollocked and chucked off and whatever. But I've never had any problem parking up here. Apart from the same, the same copper who's been caught. Well, no, I think he just come across me one time. You know, so I hope you're not going to park here tonight. I thought we were the last fucking two nights. Nobody said nothing. And I parked on a road, which people walk up, park up, walk their dogs, you know, and go all over the bits where it says no civilian access and all this, like, you know, don't, nobody don't take the fucking notice of it. Yeah. But he didn't, he didn't strike me as a type to be, um, sort of pompous. He didn't, you know, he didn't sort of, he come across as quite a nice bloke. But... I don't know. Last time I seen him out there with that jock, he was a bit, he was a bit more, of, what do you call it? He keeps kept saying to me, I don't want to get heavy handed, I don't want to get heavy handed. I think the reason I don't want to get heavy handed is because he can't, because I'm not doing anything illegal. It's just that they don't like it. It's a bit when somebody, like, when somebody parks a van outside your house. You know what I mean? You don't like it, but you have nothing bug about it. I think it's a bit like that, you know? I want to keep everything tidy. But, yeah. Anyway, I'll let you go. I don't want really to keep harping on about that. I didn't sleep again that well last night. Really? Because, <sighs> you know, we people up here fly tipping and what have you. I'll do a little video of that maybe later. Maybe not. Anyway, I'll speak to you later. Remember to stay classy, no fighting. Bye-bye. Um, and subscribe. And please press the like button. Or press a dislike button, I don't really care. Uh, like button's better, subscribe's good. Um, bloody girt log eye, eyebrows. I bloody hell, I want bloody girt log eyebrows like that for. I never, never, never used to either. It's like hair every bloody year, isn't it? I didn't need that when I was younger, but apparently I need it now. Anyway, I'll speak to you all later. Stay classy, look, bye, Jay. Bye bye.